Global climate change is real. It's affecting this country. I think we're going to see more intense rainfall, which will result in floods. Hurricanes um, uh, and their intensity seems to have increased. If you get rising sea levels, then you're going to have massive migration because of this. And dealing with these climate, these climate um, refugees, really, is going to become a huge problem. The world is really looking again to the United States to, to re-establish its commitment uh, and, and to be a constructive player. Without U.S. action, uh, there is no international agreement. If U.S. is not engaged um, and is not constructive and does not start to move in the right direction, um, I don't think you're going to see much movement anywhere else in the world. But it's also a test of our capability as independent sovereign nations to work together to solve such a common problem. The issue about cooperation between developed and developing countries isn't an option, isn't just a good idea, it's an absolute and utter necessity. We've had hearings in the United States through the Commission. We've participated internationally with, our, with other parliamentarians through the Parliamentary Assembly. So the U.S. has shown leadership and it's making a difference. We are the persons uh, that have laid the groundwork uh, for summitry. And uh, uh, we do that extremely well in the Parliamentary Assembly and in the OSCE generally. Uh, the Helsinki Commission is a very important mechanism for providing those mutual assurances and for building trust. I think the kinds of dialogues that you see with the Helsinki Commission are really positive um, because it's in those more informal dialogues that people speak more freely um, and others can really understand the issues that we all face. The United States should be a leader, but we need to work with the international community. So within the U.S. Helsinki Commission, we are working with the other member states to say, let us take the leadership role and develop the right policies to reduce greenhouse gases and really make our, our planet safer for the future.